Good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How are you? Pretty good? Very good, teacher. And you? Very good. So Thank far, you. so good, Miss. So far, so good. Okay, excellent. I like that. Very good. Okay. Um, well, first of all, um, eh, thank you everybody for connecting um, on time. And the second thing is uh, um, I wanted to apologize, guys, that um, yesterday there was uh, a big inconvenience. I wasn't able to um, to connect to with the class. It was um, so I'm, I apologize. But um, we are going to be um, we're going to be having class on Friday to be able to um, to make up that class. Okay, all right. So, um, anybody have any questions about that? No, Miss. No. Okay. All right. Well, um, okay, so just letting you know that we are we are going to have we're going to make up that that class, right? So we're not going to you're you're still gonna have that class, okay? So just to let you know. Okay, guys, so what we're gonna do is um we're going to be um starting mm, sorry, um Okay. So what we'll do right now is before we we um, begin with the class, we need to take our attendance. Okay, so um, please uh, make sure that your camera is on. I need cameras on um, for the especially for the attendance, and um, please open up your microphone when you hear your name. Um. A, yeah, open up your microphone and close the microphone to when you finish saying present. Um, that way there is no um in, interference with the with the audio. Okay. All right. So we're gonna start. Um. Efrain Emilio Acevedo. Efraín Emilio Sabed. <clears throat> okay. Eh, Stephanie Saray Martinez. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Um, Geraldine Iset Villeda. Present, teacher. Okay, perfect. Uh, Ingrid Maricela Flores Ramirez. Here, teacher. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Um, Irma Adriana Segura Araujo. I'll repeat. Um, Irma Adriana Segura Araujo. Next up. Okay. Uh, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano Sanchez. Present. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Juan David Madrid. Present, teacher. Okay. Very good. Carla Melissa Colocho. I'm here. Okay. Very good. Um, Kevin Josias Flores, Kevin Josias Flores, okay, Lucia Elena Cepeda, present teacher, wonderful, thank you very much, uh, Mary and Daniela Carranza, Mary and Daniela Carranza, Okay, 
Milagro de la Paz Jiménez. Here I am, Miss. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Uh, Mina Janet Landos. Okay. Um, ¿Habría manera que pueda hablar, abrir la cámara para poder verla? No, no, no. Mira, ¿está teniendo problemas con la cámara? Ahí está. Oh, sí, perfecto. Sí, sí, me falla por ratos. Ok, ok. Y de repente, igual el audio me está como fallando. Entiendo, ok. Bueno, haga su mejor esfuerzo, ¿verdad? Y esperemos que se pueda solucionar. Ok. okay. okay. Eh, Nelson Adanceron. Present teacher. Wonderful. Nelson, fíjese que ahorita me está apareciendo su nombre solo como Nelson Medina. ¿Será posible que me lo pueda cambiar en la plataforma? No, este, si revisa bien en la lista, solamente tengo dos dispositivos. Ah, Uno por respaldo, por si me quedo sin red, porque como a veces me muevo por el trabajo uh -huh. y ya queda listo. Uh -huh. Sí, acá me acabo de dar cuenta. Ok, está bien, muchas gracias. Patricia Esmeralda García. Present teacher. Wonderful. Ok. Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Here I am, teacher. Wonderful. Very good. Roberto Isaias Molina. Roberto Isaias Molina. ¿No está? Uh, Ronald Alexis Martínez. Present. Wonderful. Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. No, ok. Hey, Sandra Elizabeth Asensio. Gracias, Miss. Wonderful, thank you. Ok, eh, solo quiero asegurarme que no me haya, que no se me haya escapado alguien. So, I didn't hear. Efraín Emilio Acevedo, Irma Adriana Segura, Kevin Josías Flores, Merin Daniela Carranza, eh, Roberto Isaías Molina, y eh, Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. No escuché a ninguno de ellos. ¿Am I correct? Yeah, okay. I guess. Okay. I guess Mary wrote in WhatsApp chat. Oh, okay. Uh, who? Uh -huh. Mary? Mary and Daniela? Mary. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah. Okay. Efraín Emilio Acevedo says present too. Present. Efraín. Okay. Efraín, are you there? He broke on the chat, miss. You were in the chat. Okay. Ya voy a revisar entonces. Okay. All right, guys, so what we're going to do then is we're going to start with our class. Please tell me if you are able to see my screen. So just one moment. Okay. All right, just a moment. We're going to miss Sunday. And then try again. Okay, let me see. Can you see it? Can you see my screen? Yes. 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 Excellent. Okay. So, uh, we have a conversation here between Daniel and Andrea. So yesterday we were talking. Sorry, sorry, not yesterday. The day before we were talking about um, a little bit about a uh, science uh, and yes, yes, of course, and technology. 
advances. So here we're gonna have, we have Daniel and Andrea talking a little bit about this. So please listen and repeat. Hey, nice computer. Hey, hey nice, computer. nice computer. Mm -hmm. Good. What's this for? What's what this for? This for? <clears throat> That's a modem. That's, That's a modem. modem. It's used to connect. It's used to connect. connect. The computer to the phone line. The computer, the computer to the phone, the phone line. Mm -hmm. So I can send faxes. So I, I can send faxes. faxes. And access the internet. And access the internet. Mm -hmm. Good. So you can go online. So you so can, go, you can go, go online. Online. And all that. And all that. Yes. 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 And I use the World Wide Web. Yeah, I use the for finding information. For finding, for finding information. information on astronomy. On astronomy. Movies. 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 UFOs. 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 Just about anything. Just about, Just about anything. 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 Sports. 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 Cars. 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 Mm -hmm. mm. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And I can exchange information. And I can information with people. With people. 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 Two. 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 I belong to a chat group. I belong to a chat group on astronomy. On astronomy. And astronomy. Okay, very good. Uh, hmm. Mm. Hmm. I just use my computer. I just, I just use, use my, computer my computer to write letters and reports. To so write, write letters, letters and reports. And reports. <laughs> Why don't you get on the internet? Why, Why don't you get, get the internet? internet? I'll repeat. Why don't you get? Why don't, Why you, don't, don't you get, get on the internet? On the on internet. internet. It's not really expensive. It's, it's not really expensive. 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 Yes. Well, sorry, maybe I will. Maybe, maybe I will. will. It sounds like fun. It, it sounds, sounds like, like fun. fun. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very, very good. Okay, bravo. Bravo. Excellent. Okay, so, um, do you have any questions about this vocabulary? Any questions about this vocabulary? What you UFOs mean? Hmm. That's a very good question. Um. So 
UFOs. UFO stands for unidentified. Hold on. Unidentified. In Spanish. Yes. Sign. Line. Mm -hmm. Object. Which means it, it's a it's an object in the sky that we don't know what it is. Okay. Unknown. Okay. Unknown. Yeah, it's unknown. So some unknown. people. Unknown. Yeah, unknown. Uh, so some people think that um, you know, ovnis or UFOs are aliens, but all it means unidentified flying object it means that we don't know what it is it's flying in the sky but we don't know what it is that's it okay okay all right any other questions about this vocabulary Mm-hmm. What is the meaning exchange como in, like intercambiar information? Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. That's exactly what oh, it means. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so it means that I have information, you have information, I give you information and you give me information. So it's only uh for information or uh, I say the apple uh, for uh, well, orange. Well, in this context, we're talking about information. It's an exchange information, right? So that's why I mentioned exchange information. But it, you can exchange anything. You can no, no. Yeah, you can exchange knowledge. You can yes. exchange. Oh, but, uh, lo decía por la cuestión teacher de de dot com, o sea que es exclusivo para para la cuestión prácticamente de direcciones internet de de internet, ¿no? o sea dot com el punto point, o sea no se usa point sino que dot com. Eh, por eso preguntaba si exchange 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 perdón es solo para información directamente o, o se puede ocupar en cualquier otro contexto. No, no, exchange just means that I have something, you have something, and we I give you what I have, and you give me what you have. For example, we can exchange telephone numbers. So it means that I give you my telephone number and you give me oh. your telephone number. So it can it can be in any context. Thanks. Okay. Yes. Anything else? Any other vocabulary that you're wondering about? No? Okay. What about the the um what about the what's it called? Um ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the pronunciation. Do you have questions about the pronunciation? No, miss. No? No. So all the words are clear? No. All the words? I think so. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, in that case, what we're gonna do is we're gonna practice this conversation um, with a partner. Okay, so just give me a moment. Give me one moment.
All right, so I'm going to be sending the the conversation in the chat, in the WhatsApp chat, okay? So you can have it there. Um, just please confirm that you do have it. Okay, can you please confirm that you have it? I don't have it. No, miss. Um, no. Uh, well, no. Just, right, just now. right now. Perfect. Just right now. Perfect. Okay, wonderful. All right, so what we're going to do then is we're going to be putting you guys into breakout rooms so that you can practice, okay? I just want to make sure that I have everybody here that is going to be participating. Um, Efrain Emilio, will you be participating? Efrain Emilio, yes, no. Just want to make sure. Okay. Okay, perfect, Efrain. Um, oh. Okay, well, hmm, I'm just wondering if this is gonna work. But well, yeah, it is. Um, okay, uh, Ingrid Maricela, are you there? Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect, wonderful. Um, Mirna Janet? Yes, teacher. Will you be participating? Yeah, okay, wonderful. <laughs> And uh, Nelson Adan? Nelson Adan? Nelson Adan? Nelson Adan, I guess, is not going to be participating. Okay. All right. Um, in that case, um, okay. We're going to put you guys into breakout rooms uh, for about four minutes and then we'll return. Okay, so here we go. Let's open the rooms. to connect to the phone line so I can send faxes and access the internet. So you can go online and all up? Yes, and I use the worldwide web for finding information on astronomy, movies, UFOs, just about anything. Sport, card. Um, I can exchange information with people too. I belong to a chat group on astronomy. Mm, I just use uh, my computer to write uh, later um, reports. Why don't you get on the internet? It's not really expensive. Maybe I will. It is, sounds like a fool. Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay. Hi. Nice computer. What is What is a modem? This used uh, to connect the computer to the phone line so I can send faxes and access the internet. So you can go online and all that? Yes, I can use the World Wide Web for field, field information on astronomy, movies, UFO, use about anything. It's for cars? Mm, 
Um, I, I can exchange information with people too. I belong to a group on astronomy. Hmm. I just use my computer to write letters and reports. Why don't you get on the internet? It's not really expensive. Maybe I will. It sound like fun. All right. Okay. Repet Repetimos o no sé. No sé. Creo que a ver a ver si hay, si si la teacher tiene ahí algunas observaciones. <laughs> you are, you're doing actually very good. Um, you're you're pronouncing the words fine, so I I don't have any observations for you right now. Um, there's only ten seconds left of this, uh, and then we're gonna go back to the main room. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. See you in a moment. Okay. All right, guys and girls. Uh, do you have any questions about the pronunciation? Anything at all? Anything you want to ask? About? No? Okay. All right. Wonderful. So uh, we're going to move on. Please tell me if you can see my screen. Yes, yeah. yeah. Okay, wonderful. So we're going to be talking about infinitives and gerunds here. You know, when there is an invention, the person who creates that invention has a purpose for that invention, right? They created not just to create, they created for a specific purpose. So we talk about this purpose in two different ways, using infinitives and using gerunds. So for example, we have infinitives and gerunds can describe a use or a purpose. Infinitives, a modem is used to connect computers to phones. So what's the use? What's the reason uh, or, or why, why do we use modems? Who can tell me? I use modern teacher. Okay, and what do you use modems for? What what is what is the use of them? Okay. What first is the use? Uh huh. First of all, a modern is some ancient technology. Uh, this device is not used anymore because I think that any company that distribute uh, internet service connections don't use a, a modern like uh, to, to to connect the computer to the to the internet. Uh, yes, uh, this technology was used in the middle of the nineteenth century. Or uh, nighting, uh, I, I I use a modern in the nineteen ninety nine, for example, and the uh, beginnings of of the two thousand to two thousand two or two thousand three, and the modern was replaced for an ADCL connection, but this technology is not used anymore. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Ronald. Uh, can may, can I ask what is your what is your profession? I am in uh, informatics. 
I software engineer. Okay. Okay, you're a computer engineer. Okay, huh? so that's why he knows. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you very much, Ronald, for that very in informative um, uh, explanation of the yeah. of the modems. Yes, very good. So, yes, everything Ronald said is very true. Um, do you remember using modems? How many of you remember using modems? Uh, I remember used modem modems. Okay, you remember Patricia using modems. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It can somebody remember what what it was? What was the 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 sound that you would get when you were using a modem? <laughs> and, and the 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 sharp sharp the pace is is long, very slow in in part in the spring. Exactly. Actually, actually, you can use the 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 phone for making a a call phone if you are using the modern connection. When you pick up the the, the headphone. You can hear that that noise. Interesting, yeah. So the the younger generations will have no idea what we're talking about. <laughs> uh, like uh, I don't know. I have a feeling, like uh, for example, Stephanie Sarai. I have a feeling you have no idea what we're talking about, right? No, I don't have idea. <laughs> Yes, I know. I know that's 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 something um, that I think will separate forever uh, the two generations. You know, the millennials from from generation um, X, right? Um, no, I'm sorry, not. Yeah, no, generation Y. I forgot which one generation you guys are. But anyways, yes, that 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 is a very different. So yes, before when we started using. Mm -hmm. Um, when we started using the internet, we would use modems, which were connecting the computers uh, to the phones. And uh, we would have a very, very, very slow connection to the internet. And um, every time you connected to the internet, we'd have a very strange sound. So anyway, think, I'm talking a little bit about the connection. The modem is used, notice, is used to connect computers to phones. So that's the reason um, that's uh, the, the describing the use or the purpose of it, okay? So here we have um, is, is used to, okay? Is used to, but we can also say it's used Sorry, it's used. And instead of saying to connect, we can say for connecting. Do you see the difference? So one is using the in, the infinitive, okay, yes. with the, the two infinitives. So you put two yes. and then the, the, the verb in the base form. And the other one is using for and then the ing form. Mm -hmm. All right. So we have one is using two and the one the other one is using for. Okay. And I want you to notice that um the well we have the in this case the connect is in the base form of the verb and here is with the ing form that's why we call it the gerund does that make sense yes yeah sense. so we never we never put them together we never say two four for example we never say a modem is used Two for connecting. They can't say two for connecting or two for connect. No. We say either 
to connect or for connecting. Okay, it, the same thing happens with the next sentence here. Computers are often, so are often used, used, okay? And again, we have the, the to infinitive, to write. Computers are often used to write letters. Or we can also use the for, Right. For writing letters. Okay, are used. And then yes, we're used, we're gonna we can use the for plus the gerund for writing letters. It's the same thing. So it, it doesn't have a difference in meaning, okay? It doesn't have a difference in meaning. You you can say you can say both of them and they mean the exact same thing. It's just that the grammar is different. Okay? It's like it's like the same thing as saying I love watching TV and is the same thing as I love to watch TV. So it doesn't make it's not it doesn't change the meaning, okay? So the same thing here, it doesn't change the meaning. Okay? Or the next sentence for example, we have I can use the World Wide Web. I can use the World Wide Web. And then here we have to find. We have the to infinitive, to find. To find information. Or I can use, I can use it. Why? for finding information. We're using for plus the gerund for finding. Sounds good, everybody? Yes. Yes, it sounds good. Any questions? No. It's clear. It's clear. Oops. Okay, all right. So hopefully it's clear. Are you sure anybody wants to ask something? You're more than welcome to ask. Okay. All right, so in that case, since you don't have any questions, um, I'm going to ask you to work on the exercise, which are these, okay? So it says, what do you know about this technology? Complete the phrases in column A with the um, information from column B. Then compare with a partner. So actually gonna do it with a partner. So, so for example, satellites are used and notice it says that more than one answer is possible. So let's do it together. Satellites are used to study the used? worst weather. Are used to study to the... study the worst weather. Okay. All right. So we can say satellites are used to study the world's weather, or we can say sat satellites are used for, 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 for study. Studying. For studying. For studying. The world's weather. Okay, so basically, Doesn't need telephone calls. Yeah. So, um, but okay. Yeah, there are many possibilities. But what's important here is that you understand. So we can say to study, or, or studying. Or studying. That's what's important here. That we 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 can choose to use either to study, or for studying. Sounds good. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Does that make mm -hmm. sense for everybody? Yes. yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. All right. Uh, tengo, una, tengo una pregunta. En español, prácticamente el gerundio es eh, cuando se le agrega el y, y 
yendo, yendo a, a la cuestión del, del verbo, ¿no? Riendo, comiendo, en el caso del inglés es prácticamente igual. Would you be so kind, Juan David, to ask that question in English? English, okay. Yeah, teacher. In English. Teacher, in, in English, and mm -hmm. the challenges is same in like the Spanish, you had a, a, um, and the verb uh, have a plus endo. Yes and no. So, um, okay. So, yes. Um, in the the, um, we could we can use, um, gerunds like in Spanish we use, a eh, and like endo ando, uh, right like like what we call in Spanish, gerundios. But the difference is that in Spanish, gerundios are always verbs. Okay? In Spanish, siempre son verbs. Yes. Okay? But in English, gerunds are not verbs. Gerunds are actually nouns. Okay. Okay, understand. Yeah. And and, and it's, this is, uh, o sea, les estoy adelantando, eh, pero, o sea, un montón porque ahorita no estamos viendo bien ese ese tema, pero y, eh, pero si ustedes se van grabando en la mente eso, gerunds in English are nouns, not verbs, then it makes things easier to understand. Why? Because then you understand that we are not, and I repeat, not using two verbs. Okay? Because you may think, ah, use are used is a verb. So we're using two verbs. No, we are not using two verbs. We're using a verb and a noun. Okay? In English, we never use two verbs together. We use a verb and then the noun. And the noun can be in, this, in the form of an infinitive or a gerund. Does that make sense to you? Yeah, yeah. I understand the truth. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Any other questions that you have? Okay. All right. In that case, I'm going to send you the exercise in the WhatsApp. Are you there? You have it? Yeah? Yes. Perfect. Okay, good. So what we'll mm -hmm. do right now is um, I will send you guys to the breakout rooms to work on the exercise. I will send you to the same with the same partner so that it's easier just to keep the same group. But I'm not sure if everybody's here. Uh, Ingrid Maricela, are you here? Ah, oh, there she is. Yes, I'm here, teacher. All right, good. And Ronald Alexis. All right, wonderful. And Mirna Janet. And Carla Melissa. Okay, eh, Kevin Flores. Present, teacher, present. Okay, will you be participating, Kevin? Will you participate in the groups? Eh, Kevin, just wondering, will you be participating in the group? Mm -hmm. 
¿Puede participar en el grupo, Kevin? ¿O no? Ok. Got it, got it. Um, quiero ver qué más. Carla Melissa. Ok. Okay, so I'm going to send you right now to the breakout rooms, and here we go. Carla Melissa. ¿Está usted ahí, Carla? Carla Melissa. Carla Melissa. Puedo tener varios. What? Yes, maybe. You can use people that uh, use the internet to make travel reservation. Okay. Uh -huh. And DNA fin fi fingerprinting is used uh, 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 to, ident to identify criminals. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And a uh, CD room, yeah. CD room is uh, the hard, the, the hard disk. Sometimes some... use the uh, read the latest weather report. You know, transmit television program programs, a store and encyclopedia. I don't uh, know. No. Maybe the last one. Store C and encyclopedia. Uh, CD room. Con... CD room. Pero eso eran como los. Uh -huh. Los CD, lo, lo eso para, para poner. Pero no era para comprar. O no, sí. It's not for computer CD room. Ah, uh, no. Tra uh... To transmit the te television programs, that can be. Uh -huh. mm, I don't know. And satellites are used to 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 read the latest. No, the satellites are used to transmit television program. To transmit television. See. Uh -huh. See. Sí. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, and, the, and, and that at city room is sometimes used. Uh, what, is, what is city room? City room. What is city room? Maybe read the late weather report. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see. What is CD room web? What is CD room? The function a compact disc used 
has a read only optical memory. No, no. What is the difference? I don't know. I don't know. Voy a buscar. Uh -huh. Yo creo uh, que es algo que, que la room is, is, uh -huh, is a, a, when you you put a, 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 a disc one? you put a disc on the CD ah, room. Ah, vaya, uh -huh. leer difusión. Uh -huh. Read the latest report, maybe. Read the latest. Weather report. Uh -huh, no, porque es como que lo podía grabar y después leerlo. Read the latest weather report. Okay. Is to... Okay. Read late the latest. The latest. Como después, como más tarde. Uh -huh. Read the latest. The latest. Mm -hmm. nice. Y la de study the world weather. Mm -hmm. Y de study the world weather. The satellites are used to. I mean. Report. No, eh, 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 that's not. See the room is sometimes, no. Okay, the meaning of the read the latest weather report is como a, a, a report to the, to the, el reporte meteorológico es. Uh -huh. That's not city room. What is city room? Sometimes used transmit television programs and store encyclopedia to make a photocopy. Y esa de store encyclopedia tampoco la hemos usado. Uh -huh. That can be city room. Okay, are we ready to check the answers? Yeah, ready to check? Okay. Yes. Wonderful. All right. So please um, tell me if you can see my screen. Mm -hmm. You see my screen? Yes. Mm -hmm. oh. Yes. All right. Yes. All right. So we can say satellites are used to study or study the world's weather, or satellites are used for studying the world's weather. Right. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Another one. Any others? Uh, tra to transmit and television programs. Good. Satellites are used to transmit. Television programs. Television programs or satellites for use telephone calls. For, for, for transmitting, transmitting tele television programs. Transmitting television programs. Good. Mm -hmm. For transmitting television programs. Good. Any others? Satellites are we, used? We, we was wondering about the use of fax machine. Okay. We were wondering because it's we. Oh, we were wondering. Yes, I'm sorry. Okay, okay, it's okay. We'll, we'll get there in a moment. Any other mm -hmm. ones for satellites? Uh, Any more oh. for satellites? 
I, I think that's my telephone calls. Okay, so satellites are used to transmitting or to, to transmit instead of telephone calls or to transmit to, telephone. Good to transmit telephone, telephone calls, calls or for transmitting telephone calls. Good. Robots. Robots are sometimes used. Um, I think to perform dangerous tasks. That's good. Okay, to perform dangerous tasks. For performing. Yes, for performing dangerous tasks. Good. Um, robots are sometimes used. I think that's pretty much the only one. Yeah, that would fit. You can use a fax machine. Um, for uh, for me for making a photocopy. For making a photocopy, sure. Or, um, can you use it uh to? Okay, but to let's make. keep to make. A photocopy. Uh, to, yeah, to make yeah. a photocopy or yeah. for making a, a photocopy. But yes. can you use it to transmit telephone calls? Mm. Uh, no? Oh, yes? No. No? Oh, okay. Okay. No, no. C can, okay. You, uh, can you make a telephone calls by fax? I'm not no. sure. Oh, okay. No, I, I don't sure. think so, no. No? Okay. No. Okay. Mm -mm. Okay. Thank you. Okay. People use the internet. Um, read the late uh, war report. To to read? No, sorry. To read, to read, or oh, for reading. To to of uh, to read the latest weather report, or for reading the latest weather reports. Anything else? People use uh -huh. the internet. To make travel reservations Good. Or to make travel for, reservations. Making, for making travel reservations. For making travel reservations. Good. Okay. Very good. The DNA finger, fingerprinting is used. To identify criminals. To identify criminals or. For identifying. For identifying identify. criminals. Very good. Anything else? Um, Probably that's it. And that's city, it. city ROM is sometimes used to store an encyclopedia. To store an encyclopedia or for storing an encyclopedia. For storing an encyclopedia. Very good. Bravo. Excellent, guys. Very, very good. All right, I think you got it. Okay, so we're going to finish our class there. But before we finish, I need to make sure that you are all here. That, um, that uh, yeah, um, that I have all my class here. So let me click again, once again, the attendance, Efraín Emilio Acevedo. Yeah, okay, yeah. Um, got it. Esther Zayda y Martínez. Present teacher. Geraldine Lisette Villeda. Present teacher. Ingrid Maricela Flores. Here teacher. E Irma Adriana Segura. Irma Adriana Segura. Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Present Miss. Juan David Madrid. Present teacher. Carla Mel uh, Melissa Colocho. I'm here. Kevin Josías Flores. Lucía Elena Cepeda. Lucía. Lucía, no. Me, Merin Daniela Carranza. Um, Milagro de la Paz. I'm here, I'm here. Okay. Mira Janet Landos. Mira Janet. Okay, wonderful. Nelson Adán Cerón. Nelson. Okay. Patricia Esmeralda Garcia. Present teacher. Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Present. Roberto Isaías Molina. Roberto. Roberto Isaías. 
Eh, Ronald Alexis Martínez. Present teacher. Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. Roxana Elizabeth. Y Sandra Elizabeth Asensio. Yeah, yeah. Okay, wonderful. All right, guys and girls. So that is going to be all for today. I will see you tomorrow. Okay. And so have a wonderful um, evening. And um, hopefully tomorrow will be a good day. All right. So take care. Bye bye. Care. Bye bye. See you. See you. See you. See you. See you. Ay, ya nos vamos, Manzana. Ya se... Estás aburrido.